Hey guys, this is Ms. Ronald Glaze, and today we are going to um, be playing some Pokemon Go, duh. And so we're going to be, uh, power since the Equinox event just happened, we're going to be one, powering up stuff, and two, evolving stuff, in the opposite order, actually. So I'm going to be dropping a lucky egg, and we're going to be starting the evolutions. I'm just going to search to see what I can evolve. I sort it by number. Bulbasaur, I'm not going to do that, but I have a bunch of Pidgeys. I'm probably just going to speed through all the, like, not interesting. So, I have a bunch of Pokemon. So, see, I have a bunch of Gastlys. There was a, recently a Gastly nest. I got three of these good IVs. But I'm not going to evolve any of them. Because uh, there's going to be a Halloween event. And I want to do a Halloween themed video. So, I'm going to keep those. Uh, we, do, we can evolve this. We may or may not do that. We'll see. Uh, we have Eevees, we have Cyndaquil, anything else worth evolving, really? Uh, we can do these. I'll evolve two Teddy Ursus. We'll start with the lower CP one, obviously. So we are going to evolve these two Teddy Ursus. And uh, we'll see. Maybe the Tyros that I have. One of them. I want to keep at least one Tyro. Oops. That's the phone drop. Uh, so I want to keep at least one Tyro because, like, there's a Tyro. And their baby Pokemon. Bad move set, but whatever. This one's a really big one I caught in the wild. Uh, 82% IV, nine, almost a thousand CP, so 950. Really, really good. Ten years to there. Twenty-two, twenty-nine is a good move set. That is a good one. Okay, uh, we can evolve Remorite, I think. We have no candy. We'll evolve this one. I'm not really excited for Earth Ring, even though that was a high CP good one. Um, we may or may not power it up. We'll see, we'll see. I have all my power up Pokemon starred. 91% Octillery coming in here. Uh, eh, whatever. Do Tyro. Uh, 42. I really don't care which one we get. I don't have a preference. This is all just for XP, to be honest. I did hit level 32, and I'm a decent way toward toward uh, 33. Almost 200,000. Come on, Chan. Whatever. I really don't care. Uh, they're not useful in any way. I still have a bunch of vape Pokemon. No, one of the few Pokemon I need is Magby, which is kind of weird. Okay, so the thing about Chansey, my current main Bliss is in a gym, so I think we're going to evolve one of these 91% ones. Just in a second here. I'm still on the borderline about the Machamp, but this 91% one, uh, he's going into a Blissey. I'm not sure. Do I want to evolve this, or do I power up my current one? <sighs> Alright, I'm just going to wait. This one's been in the gym for a really long time. Uh, let's see. I put it in this morning. You see, almost uh, 12 hours or 11 and a half. Okay, uh, we'll, we'll go to the power ups now. Okay, uh, we'll start lower on the favorites list. It's down here. Uh, some weird Pokemon that I like. That, that I really like. We have Vileplume, Pokemon I really like. 
very underrated. This one has a good moveset. I evolved it in my grass event video, which is my favorite video I've ever made, for sure. I'm getting it around 1500, I think. Seems like a decent uh, size file plume. Um, they're not really powerful, it's just a Pokedex filler, to be honest. I hate sp spending my hard earned Stardust, though. Sometimes. But, gotta do it. Okay, we're just gonna evolve this one, or power up this one. Okay, that's gonna be, as far as we're gonna power that one up. I'm gonna unstar it. Wait, what about Scyther? I uh, was just checking, uh... Okay, we have, um, Ampharos here. We're just gonna get around 1600, I think. We do need to save some for the, like, the good Pokemon. That is a good one, actually. Um, I'm just gonna, I think we're just gonna go straight to, the, like, the really powerful ones. Okay, Execu Executor. I think we're gonna get this around 23, 2400. Uh, because this is a really good it's best moveset, and 87% IVs. I don't know what more you could want with, uh, your good executors. But, yeah, 23, 2400 on this one is what our target range-ish. I've never had a grass Pokemon in my top 12, except for maybe in the, my first month or two. I have already dropped below 100,000 Stardust. Alright, 2300. We're just gonna get it over. We're already at 90,000 Stardust. Uh, 2300 is what I was looking for. Uh, let's go with. I just wanna get into the high CP ones, to be honest. Okay, we're gonna try and max out my Vaporeon. This is my OG. One of my oldest Pokemon that I still have. Definitely my highest CP Pokemon that I got in the first month, I believe. Yep. And get it up around 2,800-ish. Okay, next one I should get it at 2,800 and it should be maxed out now. Yep, 2,808. I did recently TM it, so it has Hydro Pump, which is nice. I caught this 96%. I did post a video about it, so most of you should know about it. Um, okay. I don't think I'm going to have enough Stardust to get it anywhere near good. The Stardust spending is going to be over in minutes. Okay, it's going to be my last Stardust spent on this. I mean, it's a good ride-on, but do I really want to spend that much candy on it? That uh, seems like a decent CP, or really good CP, my bad. Then we have this 2900 Dargonite, which is going to be our main power-up candidate. And now he's officially over 3000 CP. My good old old OG Dargonite. And that's as far as I can power him up, because I'm in slight deficiency. If I power this up, I'll never be able to get a question mark CP. Okay, so this is, we're getting really over, yeah, I gotta get this over 3200. Do I power it up again or no? I can't decide, man. <laughs> Hard man. Okay. Thirty two forty seven. And now I'm gonna try and find something that cost forty five hundred to power up. No, too much. Five thousand Snorlax. Alright, we'll do a couple power ups on this guy. This is the one I hatched in my hatching video and Brown Stardust. Nice. And let's go look at our CP lineup. That has definitely changed. I like that lineup. It looks really, really nice. Oh, we forgot to do Gyarados. That's stupid of me. But whatever, guys. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye!